What's up my loves? Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Angie Monique. So today we are doing a full face of MAC Cosmetics. I told y'all I had some new products, some bronzers, some setting powder. Um, and I already had a few MAC products. Like I had a foundation. I already have like lip liners, lip like lipsticks, lip gloss, stuff like that eyeshadow but they have some new products they have the new skin finish sunstruck matte bronzers so i have these and then i also picked up the max studio fix pro set and blur weightless loose powder in my haul i told y'all i had medium deep and i mentioned that i felt like it was going to be a little too dark so i did exchange it for medium so i think this is going to work better so yeah, if you want to see how these products work on me and how we can create a full face of MAC, <laughs> this is the video for you. Come on, let's go. Okay, okay, okay. So um, let's just jump right into it. This is the MAC Studio Fix Fluid. Um, bra spectrum spf 15 i am in the shade nc 50 okay so if we are we all know mech is the mother okay she is that girl she's the goat love mech mech is just gets it for me almost every single time almost every single time okay but they have some they coming out with some bangers so they came out with some bangers that i'm hoping are going to be bangers that i can add to my collection so yeah we just gonna dive right into it as i stated this is the foundation this is not um new this is very much an og product um but i'm shaking it because i have not used this in quite a while um y'all know i am a medium to full coverage type of girl with matte products a little bit goes a long way simply because if you do too much it can go left real quick and you can be cakey and be a hot mess and we don't want that right we, we just don't want that so i like to dab this i don't have the pump which you can purchase a pump i just this this works for me so i'm just gonna take that much and that's literally too much okay that is definitely too much and i am going mm 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 I'm going to take a, this is a powder brush. Mm -mm. I don't want that. Okay. I'm going to take my Real Technique brush and dab this all over the face like this. A little bit, like I said, a little bit goes a long way. See, I still got some on my hand, right? And we're going to work with what we got first, okay? Let's blend this in. Like I said, the technique to using MAC, I know a lot of people don't don't like MAC because they are like full coverage, like beat down to the gods. That's what you're going to get. But a little bit, you can spread this and make it work for you. Where it's not too, too much. Still got some on my hands. I'm just adding a little bit more to the brush and spreading it out on the face by the time this goes up it will already be or already have been mother's day but happy mother's day i am filming this on a sunday happy mother's day to each and every last one of you who watch me that are mothers um and happy mother's day to every last one of your mothers but this is the face like i said a little bit goes a long way but it is full coverage definitely more on the fuller side than it is the medium side okay but go a little bit goes a long way just slowly build it up you don't want to do too much with me and like i said i still have some on me and we just gonna wipe that away because yeah mm -hmm. Now, I did have to get another concealer. This is the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I did get the shade NC45. Y'all know we all was NC45 at one point in life, right? But I really do think this is the best shade for me. This is what it looks like. Um, this is a full coverage concealer. This does come with a pump. So, how I am going to use this, I'm actually going to take a concealer brush and put it along my bottom um, or under my eyes blend it out as i usually do but yeah 
it just doesn't have like a doe foot applicator you literally have to use either your finger or a brush and I'm pumping okay this is a new one I'm telling y'all just got it and we just gonna do that much literally that much because this is full coverage okay like that right here put it down the nose like that yep still working with what I got baby because this is a little bit goes a long way let's blend this out and this does kind of dry real quick so and I'm remembering how I used to use this product I used to blend it out one eye at a time or do one side apply it blend it out apply it blend it out like that's how I used to do it which I'm gonna go in with a little bit more so yeah we used it so I'm just gonna take one pump yes okay let's dive into this powder like i said i did exchange the other one i went for the medium one it does come with a puff mm -mm. and it does have a seal on it which i'm trying to get off all right so i'm gonna take my sponge and press it into that concealer yeah I definitely think this is the better option because the other powder like I said it's gonna be a little too too dark for me Okay, so a few specs on this powder. This is, again, this is the Studio Fix Pro Set Plus Blur Weightless Loose Powder. It comes in six shades. Why am I looking at the monitor? It comes in six shades. <laughs> um, I have the medium. Nope. I have the medium. This is a medium beige with peach undertone for medium skin. And like I said, the shades online is very deceiving because the medium deep shows that it is tan beige with golden undertones for medium to dark skin which is the one i had at first but as y'all know that was too dark and then they also have a dark and then they also have a deep dark so this is the third shade out of the collection um so yeah so this is what the face is looking like per use i'm going to take my mac mineralized skin finish in dark and dust all over my face yes so that's that let's do something quick on the eye y'all know i'm real simple and would love to go in with this bronzer on my eye but i do have some mac eyeshadows so these are ogs um uh, i've had these for quite a while um this is when and i'm pretty sure you can still like build your own quad but this is mine and i have saddle brown script um what is this called red brick and amber light slot like these are go-to og shades like if you know you know if you had one of these palettes you know like these colors had to be in that palette had to be in that palette so yes yeah, so we are going to use these as you can see i haven't used them in quite a while but they're a little you know but we gonna rock with it so let me give me a blending brush 
and I'm going to take a brown script. Actually, I'm going to take, I'm going to mix brown script and, uh, not saddle, but brown script and red brick together. And kind of put that in the crease area on the outer and blend it into the crease. And y'all, when I say I haven't picked up this palette in so long, but I just refuse to get rid of it. Like, I've gotten rid of so much makeup, but I just I just refuse to get rid of this palette because I feel like it's you it's just a go, like for real. It's just it's just that girl. It's just that girl. No matter you you probably always need some some shades like this for real. And I'm gonna take a clean brush and I'm gonna go a little bit into saddle and kind of diffuse that a little bit. Alright, and then I'm going to take amber lights and we're gonna put it on the lid. Mm-hmm. Yes, 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 we are. If I could find okay, I guess I use this one. This is some eye brush, but it's fine. Uh-huh. Y'all see why she mm-hmm. Okay, so the eyes are done. So let's move on to these bronzers. So I originally got matte richer golden. I originally got this one. And I told y'all in that video, packaging is beautiful. This is what the packaging looks like. Super, super cute. But it's honey. This is dark. This is real dark. So, some of you in my comment section was like, you should look at um, Rich Golden and Rich Rosie. So, I got both of those. This is Matte Rich Rosie. Super, super cute. Ain't she cute? Yep, yeah, she cute. And then this is Rich Golden. This is Rich Golden. So, these are the three shades. I'm going to swatch them for you guys as well. These are the three shades that I have. Excuse the nails. Like, look, look at the bronzes. Don't look at the nails. Look at the bronze. But these are the three shades that I have. So, this is Richard Golden. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, that's a richer golden. This is rich rosy. Mm. That's that one, and then we have rich golden. So these swatches are not the best, but that's what, that's what we got. Okay. That's what we got. So I think I want to go in. I know for sure this is going to be too dark for me. No, for sure this is going to be too dark. Let's go in with Rich Golden. Let's just see if it's going to come up on me on your girl okay so i'm just going to tap in there get some on there and we're gonna pray oh oh she showed up okay she shows up let's go to this side y'all see blank canvas bronzer Blank canvas, okay. He's showing up. Okay, I want to take a little bit of Rich Rosy. I'm gonna get a clean brush. Hold on. I'm 
guess I'll use my Fenty bronzer brush. I don't really like this, but we gonna, we gonna go with it. Okay. This is Rich Rosy. Tap some of it off. Just a little bit. Okay, so I can I can do either one of these, which is which is good. Which is good. Okay. So those are the Skin Finish Sunstruck Matte Bronzers. Now, they do have a radiant formula. I didn't really want those. I definitely want to try the matte, matte ones. So, check out Ulta or Matte Cosmetics if you're interested in those. But, yeah, I think they have a good selection, um, a good variety of colors and shades to pick from. Um, but, yeah, just I'm glad we have videos like this because, like I said, on the internet colors and the shades were a little bit deceiving a little bit deceiving but whatever let's do a lip i have chestnut and cork so i'm going to go in with cork first um this is my newest baby i heard people talk about cork liner for so long and i just got it maybe a month ago and then I'm going to go a little bit with chestnut. Like that. Now, for lipsticks, I have quite a few. Sin, Ruby Woo, Lady Danger, Fresh Brew, and Velvet Teddy are all good colors to have. Like Sin, this is matte. This is what she looks like. Super, super cute, but just like this is a definitely. You can wear any shade year round, but baby, this is a fall and winter shade for me. This one here, Fresh Brew. This is a really, really good nude to pair it with a brown lip liner. So I'm going to stick that one to the side. This is Retro Matte Wooby Woo. OG, like she's that girl. If you need a good red, this is her. Ruby Woo, it ain't going nowhere either. This is also a matte lipstick. This is Lady Danger. I would never get rid of this just because if you need that spring, summer shade, that good orange for brown skin, this is her. Um, I don't hear a whole lot of people talk about Lady Danger, but this is a really, really good shade. It used to be an OG staple back in the day. I ain't getting rid of it. I'm just not going to get rid of it. Now, Velvet Teddy, this is a good everyday wearable color. I probably am going to go in with this because I think it's going to be cute. So, yeah, this is also, this is a matte lipstick as well. And Fresh Brew is a luster uh, formula. So, I mainly have mattes. I also have the Patrick Star MAC, um lip color this is in the shade this is satin this is mama star mama star is a really really good color i don't know if they longer no longer sell these but this is also a really really good color so i think i'm gonna go in with this one and a little bit of velvet teddy like that oh so cute and then a little bit of my MAC Clear Lip Gloss. Y'all know I'm just a gloss girl in general. Love a good gloss. Like, and it's going to eat every time. Every time. So, this is the finished look. Super cute. Full coverage. But, not cakey at all. Like, don't look like I have. A whole bunch of makeup pal on my face right because we don't like it right but still loving the skin still has a nice natural finish glowing finish um so yeah love 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 this these products as always will be listed down in the description box below if you're interested in some of these products if you've tried some of these products let me know down in the comment section below do you love them do you hate them because the mac baby you either love it or you hate it there's no in between there's no gray area either black or white okay no in between so yes but this is the face yeah i love it 
so you guys as always if you like this video give it a thumbs up like comment subscribe and share and as always i'll see you guys in the next video bye